Well, Marcus, welcome to Pompey. For a youngish sort of player, you seem to have been around forever. You, you actually made your debut at a very young age. Yeah, um, I've been at been at Burton since I was 14 and played in pre-season when I was 15. So it's like, it's been a long time. It's felt a long time for me, but there was a big period between there where I wasn't doing much. So it's nice to, to finally get the ball rolling and kick on and now I can uh, move on to the next step in, in my career and hopefully have a, a good good career here at Portsmouth. I mean, was it just time for you to leave Burton? Uh, yeah, it's been, it's been a great time at Burton. I've loved my time, but um, sometimes you just get opportunities that you, you can't turn down. Like, obviously, when I was younger, I remember watching Portsmouth in the Premier League and I've been here uh, played at played at Fratton Park before, and um, I know the size of the club and the the amazing fans, and I just it's just uh, a great opportunity for me to to just uh, progress my career. When did you actually know that this move was going to be likely? Um, I'd heard murmurs for for a few weeks, but nothing was ever. Uh, I was never, I never thought, like, I didn't know it was going to happen, but then it's just been literally overnight. Everything's happened so fast, so uh, it's, been, it's been a bit mad, but I'm just happy to be here and excited for what's to come. I think what would have actually clinched it is you had a blinder at Burton the last time <laughs> we played you, didn't you? You, you, you saw us apart. Yeah, <laughs> it, was, it was a good game, uh, enjoyable game to play in for us, even though... You snatched it at the end, yeah. but <laughs> uh, it was it was yeah great game to play in, um, and it's nice to be here. That's very diplomatically put because you must have been gutted. <laughs> yeah, that yeah, we were gutted, but um, I'm not sure we had much to play for at that point. But we were just we were playing really well at the end of the season. We took some points off some big teams, and then uh, we were trying to keep that run going. So we were gutted when when we lost, but. <laughs> That's football. It's <laughs> be quite an experience to play under somebody like Nigel Clough. Yeah, it's been amazing. He's he's um, he's been great with me. To be fair, and I'm I'm very grateful for for what he's done and uh, all the the game time I got last season to give me the opportunity to come to a place like this. And yeah, it's just been been a great experience. What I remember of you is you're a pacey winger. Um, <laughs> is there any more you can describe about your game? Um, I just got more than that. <laughs> I just try and um, try and create and score goals. Uh, so I'm just try and be around it, make things happen, and get on the ball and create attacks. And that's what I like to do. And hopefully, I can do do a lot of that here. Is there anything you feel you should improve on your game? Um, last season, I could have could have scored more goals. Uh, I only started playing just before Christmas. And I ended up with, I think it was six mm. in the league. But I could have, could have done even better than like, it's not terrible, but I could have done a lot better than that. Um, but I am naturally a goal scorer. It's just maybe the final, the final ball. I was maybe a bit panicky at times mm. and like snatching at things. But towards the end of the season, after I played uh, more games, I definitely started to to feel more comfortable, uh, and I scored a few goals at the end of the season. So. Hopefully I'm past uh, past that and I can just push on and start scoring scoring loads of goals and creating loads of goals. Well, you certainly went from Burton and left them a great present with a goal against Sheffield United that people will be <laughs> able to see. Uh, was that <laughs> one of your best goals? Uh, it, was, it was a good one. <laughs> um, yeah, it's always nice to score goals like that when they, when they come around. Uh, uh, I'm glad that I could show that I'm capable of doing it. I've done it before. It's been a while, but <laughs> uh, yeah, hopefully more of that to come. What has Kenny Jackett said to you today about coming here and what he expects from you? Um, he's just talked about where where he sees me in the team, really, and where I think I, I can fit in and uh, told me how how we like to play and uh, he thinks I'll, I'll fit into to what we're trying to do here, so I'm just excited to, to try and do that and uh, try and get in the team and help the team to to push on. You've got a couple of CVs with Burton promotion. Uh, we've got 
couple of promotions on yeah. your CV, I should say. Yeah. Um, do you hope for one or two more now you're here? Yeah, definitely. Um, that's that's the aim. I know that's uh, where the club should be, uh, above where we are. But um, I'll be be working uh, with the rest of the lads to try and make that happen. Um, so yeah, hopefully I can taste more of that promotion <laughs> um, uh, here. You didn't often get to play at Fratton Park as an opposing player, did you? I think you came off the bench. Uh, I once. came off. Yeah, I came off the bench once. Um, I think we might have won that game. Uh, and then I, I was here last season, but I didn't come on. But obviously that was under the lights as well yeah. in an evening game. And just the atmosphere is just incredible. The, the fans are incredible. And um, I'm just happy, happy to be here and be a part of it. And hopefully I can show them what I can do and uh, leave like yeah, <laughs> you know, okay. and, and, and you hope you hope again more goals will come. Yeah, definitely. Uh, I just want to show what I can do. Uh, I know I'm capable of it, so it's just uh, getting out there and doing it, and that's down to me. But I'll be I'll be working to do that every day, and hopefully I have a, a good time here.